What's up? Welcome. Today we're going to be listening to a new Fit for a King track called End, in brackets, The Other Side. Fit for a King, what an interesting band. What a what an exciting band. Every time they drop something. I feel at times people have been unnecessarily harsh towards them, uh, especially when it all began with uh, the album The Path, which was definitely a different direction for the band. I don't think I liked it as much as I did their previous works, but I didn't think it was a horrible worst album of the year, something that a lot of people I saw in the comments saying. But regardless of that, this is a new album cycle. Uh, super exciting stuff. The new cover art dropped and it looks ridiculously good. It gets me super excited about their new stuff. It gets me super excited. Reaper was great, but I know they can do so much better. So this is it and the other side official music video. Let's get into it. The other side. Oh, damn. This reminds me of Phineas in a very best way possible. Damn. Okay, Riffage, Riffage. This gets me creepy. <laughs> Come on. The chorus. This is a nice callback to their older style, while still being pretty new, pretty fresh. This, this song weirdly reflects, uh, I think it was Louder Voice on the Path album. It reminds me a lot of that song, which is, as far as, as I'm concerned, one of the better songs Fit for a King of ever written. Oh yeah. Love hearing those back and forth. Hell yes. Chill section? Never mind. Will you This is awesome. I really love this chorus. It sounds familiar. Split it up, of course. <laughs> this is beautiful. Beauty. Okay. Where are we going? What a track! What a track from Fit for a King. There you go. End. The other side. 
How do you feel about that one? I, I feel like this is a song that uh, a lot of people, including those who have been criticizing the band, uh, are going to love. There, there is something super familiar and nostalgic about this sound. It sort of kind of feels like their older albums, namely Death Grip, maybe maybe even Dark Skies more so with the with the connection between the more melodic stuff and the more um, heavy stuff, which there was a lot of both here. And I, I really liked how it all came together. The chorus is catchy, the chorus is memorable, and I think the lyrics, I, I haven't really... Again, I I don't really usually pay that much attention to lyrics on my first listen to the song because I mainly I mainly focus on the music aspect of it. But um, yeah, that's that's definitely something I wanted to check out later. the The sound I I really enjoyed. I think I think this song, I think this song is just all around an awesome fit for a King song. It's got that grit on the verses. The second verse is just a fucking mosh pit festival. And then it all culminates kind of at the end of the song with the last section of the track, which is a massive breakdown, which is, again, a two-parter breakdown. My favorite. Again, I feel like uh, I feel like the only thing, the only little nitpick that I that I have, because I always got to have a nitpick. I'm an asshole. You know me. I feel like the, the way the song just kind of drops off into the build-up to the breakdown is a bit, a bit of a jarring transition. It's just kind of... Just kind of stops, but at the same time, I, I I feel like it oddly worked. So I don't even know. I, I, I personally I like that transition. It is a bit crazy. A bit, it is a bit abrupt, but I think it it really really worked. It was a nice kind of turnaround for the song. And what's more important, the song stayed like that for the rest of its duration. It didn't really go back into the melodic, which would have been pretty confusing. So. This is awesome. Yeah, no, this is this is a this is a fucking solid. This is a solid like nine out of ten for me, for Fit for a King. This is awesome. Fit for a King and the other side. What do you think about this new track from them? I would love to hear your opinions on this. Of course, let me know in the comments down below. That is going to be it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch. That's where I stream every Saturday around three p.m. Also. Check out my Patreon, that's where you get access to my Discord, as well as some exclusive full album reactions, like there's going to be this full album reaction when this album drops. Of course, needless to say, subscribe to the channel. We're trying to hit something by the end of the year. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.